Hello, my name is Kat and I am a first year TV production undergraduate student here at Bournemouth University. I'm going to be telling you about my first year experience in Purbeck House, which is one of the Lansdowne accommodation options that you can choose on the portal when the time comes. I'm going to be showing you around the bedrooms that we get and the kitchen and at the end of the video I'll be showing you a little slideshow of some of the clips of our common room, courtyard and front of the building. So that was Perbeck House's kitchen, which is a kitchen that I absolutely love because it's only shared by myself and four other people. Uh, we all shared the fridge, freezer, hob, oven and microwave. Uh, we also bought a toaster because Perbeck does not uh, include that in the kitchen, unfortunately. But we went out to Asda down the road and got that for ourselves. We recently had a movie night there and we could change the seating area around. Uh, we lined up all the seats against the window um, and faced it towards the island where we had a little monitor that was screening Harry Potter, I think it was the other day. Um, but yeah, the kitchen's great because it's a good uh, communal area so you can go and socialise with your flatmates or have little flat parties if you prefer. Um, yeah, it's a great kitchen really. So that was an example of one of Perbeck House's uh, ensuite bedrooms. The only major difference in each uh, Perbeck bedroom is that the bed can be on the other side of the room. Not sure why, but it doesn't really make a difference. The single beds, even though there's a single bed instead of a double bed, it's really comfortable. Um, we also get given these really big notice boards where you can pin your photos or notices that you get from Freshers' Fair or even a calendar you can put up there. It's great, it's a lot of space. You've got two shelving units either side of the desk. Um, and yeah, the desk is my absolute favorite item about this uh, bedroom in Perbeck because it is the width of the room and it also comes out from the wall quite far. So there's adequate space for one or two monitors or you can have all your books in one end, you can have your study area in the other and you can have like a little like, snack area, which is what I've done here. I've got like a getting ready area to my left, I've got my PC on my right and I've got my big monitor right in front of me which is really helpful for uh, editing. So uh, yeah, the ensuite bedroom is really lovely.